Hello, it's Angie with Heart Wellness Coaching. A quick post about comfort zones and how they may not serve us so well. A mentor of mine commonly says, your comfort zone is where your dreams go to die. Your comfort zone is where your dreams go to die. And that really struck me because as an introvert, a people loving introvert, but an introvert nonetheless, um, I think I probably say no to things a lot because it's outside my comfort zone. I accepted an invitation to a gathering this weekend and I was really ha having a lot of anxiety about going. I have never met, had never met the host, wasn't sure I would know anyone. So I found a wing woman and uh, she accompanied me and we went out and spent the day uh, playing on the river um, on the property uh, where this gathering was and enjoying great conversation with some great people, enjoying the sun, enjoying just the, the fellowship and the beautiful day. And I'm super glad I went. And I feel like I've probably made some friends that I will continue to have. So I, it got me thinking, how many times have I avoided things because of it, it may make me uncomfortable? Opening this practice, starting this online coaching business is definitely outside my comfort zone. Posting these videos is definitely outside my comfort zone. I still haven't done a live one, which I am planning to do at some point, but it's outside my comfort zone. So I, I thought I would post about that and maybe get some of you thinking about where you might be avoiding things because they're outside your comfort zone. So maybe give that some thought. Maybe there's some things that you would like to be doing, some ways you'd like your life to be different, but familiar is comfortable, even if it's not always the best thing for us. So just thought I'd post it. I hope you have all been having a wonderful weekend and still enjoying it. Happy Father's Day to the fathers out there. And I hope you have a great week ahead. All right, bye-bye.